this thing is called the Chef IQ. It looks so chic and sleek. This is not sponsored at all. Our friends got this for us and I'm just trying it out for the first time. Hopefully this recipe goes well. I'm kind of mixing up the ingredients. I'm not following the recipe exactly, but I think it'll turn out okay. I've actually never used one of these things. I've used a slow cooker like a few times. We got rid of our slow cooker a little while ago after we got another pressure cooker that was gifted, but we never used that one. It was just sitting here. I'm gonna give that one to my sister. It's like brand new, but I like trying one of these. I think you can make a ton of things like pho or like Taiwanese beef noodle soup in an hour. It's amazing. Here it is, guys. The beef stew came out perfect. Cannot wait to eat this. I cannot believe we're in June. I feel like I had nothing planned for June and then all of a sudden today, my calendar started filling up with random stuff. My mom's birthday is on the 20th. She goes by the Chinese calendar, so we celebrate according to that. And then that's also Father's Day. So that whole weekend, uh, I'll be hanging out with my family. We're doing something with my mom and then something with my dad because they're divorced. Josh's birthday's on the 11th, mine is on the 30th, and things are just opening up again. So I feel like we've been hanging out with people and making plans with people that we've been wanting to see or hang out with. And then I've just been catching up on work all day, and then I made this food. <laughs> up bright and early. We're going to plate fit in Sherman Oaks, or Studio City. I'm trying to get there a little bit early to take some pictures, but so we're not that early. No, I didn't move. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. about my outfit. This really cute Terry set from Waif. I'm styling it with my new Gucci sandals. I feel so summer right now. I'm headed to a showroom appointment with Eugenie. She's on her way right now. And then we're gonna ride down together to West Hollywood to the Posse showroom. I've been working with them for many years and I just got some like patio furniture that we're just gonna have a little Happy hour session, Powell will be there. Ellen was supposed to come, but I think she has to deal with some house stuff. So it's gonna be us. I think I'm gonna bring Kumo because he's been stuck at home all day and no one's been playing with him. <laughs> Guys, the welcome mat too. Oh, of course. <laughs> Gorgeous cheese board. Marley's pouring the wine. the other day so this is how we've been opening the door we have to keep the door closed because kuma's been peeing ready to run some errands with my errand boy good morning happy saturday we are going to get some breakfast at this place called hank's that we always pass by and we've never been to but it looks really good they have bagels there i'm trying to get coffee Kumo needs his coffee. And then we're just running some errands and then we have some people coming over tonight. Last time when we did that, when Ewan and Jeremy were in town, it was so fun. We karaoke, just had a small group over for drinks and snacks and we're gonna do that again.
the two that were on time. We made it. You guys are the stars tonight. <laughs> guys, You're so cool. Angel. Hi. So Kumo's girlfriend is here, Angel. She's a sweetie pie. Oh my god, they're like literally clones. Yeah, look at her freaking pigtails. It's so cute. Kumo. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Cute. Brought her home today from Mickey Hardigay's. This plant was in the corner up there, but I don't know what we're, gonna, what we're gonna do with it now. And then we bought this planter thinking that we would put a Birds of Paradise in there, but obviously it's way too small. But I love it, she's a cutie. Feels like Tulum in here now. Hello, my friends. Today is Tuesday, June 8th. I can't believe it's June, that's so crazy. Um, but I just found out that I'm going to Vegas this weekend. Uh, we're leaving on Thursday and we're gonna be there for a new ho hotel opening. Um, it's Virgin Hotels along with a restaurant called Cassie here in LA. I think they're opening a beach club in the hotel. So that's gonna be exciting. I'm excited to be in Vegas. It's been a long time since we went. Um, I think we also get to see Christina Aguilera, which will be fun. Um, I don't have any clothes to wear in Vegas. So I'm gonna stop by a showroom um, that I used to go to all all the time pre-COVID, but I'm gonna see if she has anything for me to wear there because it's gonna be really hot, I'm sure, and I don't have any like Vegasy dresses, so we'll go check it out. You wanna go with me? Let's go. Come on. Come on, Ty. Good boy. Let's go. Let's go. Just got back from the showroom and I'm making a late lunch because I just had yogurt this morning and I'm really hungry. But my dad bought these for me. I have not had dim sum since before COVID. So I'm excited to try these. You just put them in the steamer. We'll see how it goes. These took way longer than the suggested cook time, but it looks so good. Mm. Not bad. Pretty good. We've been married for like three months now. Got these thank you cards maybe like a month after we got married and they've just been sitting on my desk. I sent out like four. I still have like another 10 to go probably. <sighs> this has been on my to-do list for a while. I've just been putting it off. I think I should try to finish them today and get these sent out before we leave for Vegas. Making some soup. Got some tortellini I'm throwing and then some kale as well. And it's gonna be ready to go. is dinner sausage kale and tortellini soup it's been a crazy day not overwhelmed but a little stressed right now i'm trying to clean up my office before we leave for vegas tomorrow but i'm also trying to pack and I am way over packing. We're only going for three nights and I'm filling up my suitcase with clothes because I just don't know what to wear for Vegas anymore. <laughs> I haven't been to Vegas in like almost two years and I just don't know like what's cool to wear in Vegas anymore. I just feel so old right now. I'm like packing my stuff and I feel like this feels kind of old to me. I don't know. Am I supposed to show a lot of skin or like, I just don't even know right now. This is my suitcase. The rest of my office is a shit show. 
But yeah, three nights and I'm filling up an entire check-in luggage. Wish me luck. Thank <music> you.